Hi Claire, you look amazing. Thanks, I'm ready to dive in, Josh. Yeah. <laughs> For this week's WOW, we're going to be taking a look at part of the Treasures of the Earth that deals with underwater archaeology Ooh. and a really cool shipwreck. Oh yeah, Josh, but not just any shipwreck, mm -hmm. a pirate shipwreck. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 but not just any pirate shipwreck, the shipwreck of Captain... Of Captain... Josh! Sorry. Captain Kidd! Whoa. Oh, wait. Ah. Was he a pirate or was he a privateer? Oh, good question. I don't know. But we'll figure it out when the exhibit opens. Hm? Yeah, we'll take a look at how he made this exhibit. And of course, to recreate a shipwreck, we have to go to the experts. Yep. Let's go do that. Okay. You can see the video, you can see the artifacts, you can gain a sense of the history, the importance of these living museums in the sea. This is Charlie Beaker, an underwater archaeologist. He led a team of researchers in the excavation of this shipwreck. The underwater realm, the, the oceans, is a natural intrigue. You put a shipwreck in that water and everyone gets excited. I remember being a young kid, I'm sure everyone else remembers being a young kid. The kids will want to know more. They're going to be like sponges, wanting to hear the history, wanting to hear the, about the archaeology and the ships and the corals. But also, as good teachers, we're going to educate them on what the world was like in the 17th century, what that tells us about life today. And so we got this opportunity to get the kids excited, which they will be, and then teach them along the way. And to me, the treasure is the ships themselves. But certainly, I mean, diagnostic would be things like, you know, the blooms. Everybody likes pieces of eight. This is silver that was cut in eight pieces. That's why they call it a piece of eight. Each one is hand stamped. You can see the shield and the symbols on it. Others are not uncovered yet. This is the silver oxide. So we purposely uncovered a couple for diagnostic purposes and the others we did not uncover because we want to be able to show what it looks like underwater and it's actual when we recovered it. One really cool thing about this area of the exhibit is that we'll have a cannon. Yeah, a real cannon. From the Kara Merchant, Captain Kidd's ship. It will be here in the museum for you to see. And for us to help conserve. Wow, I'm excited for this wait. adventure. Yes, yeah, let's yes. go. I'm ready. Let's get wet. Uh, uh, Claire, there's no extra water in the exhibit. What that... do you mean? Why I buy these flippers and all this stuff? I never told you to buy anything like that. Aw, oh, bummer. There's wait. no water? Uh, well, we can still test out your stuff, though. Yeah? Yeah, I got a kiddie pool that we bathe my dogs in. Oh, cool. Let's go. Yeah, we'll see you next time on this, this week's week. Wow. Wow.